Hey folks, I'm glad you uh, came back with me because I forgot to let you know about what happened on Friday, March 18. I'm not really into the little lift line thing, but I know it's something that they claim makes us more money, which to me it seemed like they're taking away some of the money because we have two people in the car that's two different parties and they're supposed to like share the ride. So that means they're like sharing the cost of how much we would make on one car. So, I requested, well, somebody requested me, and later on in the trip, you get another request, and it's a, a line, which is a, like a carpool kind of situation, and um, I didn't accept it, because I just didn't feel that it was right at that point. So, anyway, it was canceled, and they weren't charged, which was good. So then I received another call uh, from the country club area to uh, Koreatown, uh, dropped off two uh, Asian girls. Uh, then I picked up uh, someone else in the Westwood area, dropped them off in Hollywood. Now the funny thing about that was, sometimes when people come outside, I like to throw on my hazard lights. That way if you're like five houses away for whatever reason, you'll know that I'm the one that's actually waiting for you because I don't have the little mustache in my car yet. So I picked up this guy. He was like, oh, my friend is coming too. So it was two guys and a girl, and they uh, go to UCLA. And after I got like maybe, I don't know, five blocks away, one of them said, oh, I forgot the flask. And I'm like, well, you want me to go back? And they were like, nah, that's all right. We'll just... uh." go back well, hopefully we'll meet somebody that'll pay for their trip and i was like um oh okay i mean not their trip but their drinks so as we got there we were getting there and uh we were almost there and the girl in the back was like man i just really had my mind set on that drink and i'm like what do y'all need some money so i took out a 20 dollar bill and I was going to give it to him. He was like, oh, no, we can't take money from you. And I said, okay, you sure? And he was like, oh, yeah, yeah, we're sure. And I said, because I found it. So it's not like I really need it, but I found it in my room. I was looking for something, and it just happened to be sitting under some box. So um, they were like, oh, no, we can't take any of your money. And I said, okay, no problem. Hopefully you guys will, you know, get your drinks going or whatever, and you guys can enjoy yourself. He was like, yeah, it's okay, it's cool. But he was like, you know, that's very nice of you, but that's all right. So uh, I was happy to say, um, you know, they had fun. And the funny thing about it, in the car, it's like every song that I was playing, not me, but the radio was playing on the radio. The guy in the back, who happened to be ca Caucasian, he happens to know all the words. Seemed like about five songs came on in 5, 10, 15. It took about 30 minutes to get there. So about five different songs came on. He knew the words to everything. It's, a major, it's, it's amazing to see so many people of all, excuse me, all nationality actually like the music that's out now. And it's a lot of R&B, a lot of rap. So they know the dances. They know the music. They know the songs. Excuse me, I'm sitting here drinking a... Grande Honey Frappuccino, which is new from Starbucks. But anyway, um, mm, mm, mm. and it's with soy, so I won't have problems going to the bathroom later on. So that's about it. That's my um, whole week vacation driving for Lyft, and once again. Like my page, leave a comment if you have any questions, um, subscribe to my channel, and like everyone else, share on your social media, and let me say uh, one more thing. The good thing about this is, it's like it has GPS in the app, so wherever you are throughout your day, they, they have a notification that lets them know where you are, so if you decide you want to do Lyft or click on it, turn on your app, it'll send you review uh, requests for people that's in that area. So it's not like I have to come all the way home to find someone in my area. So wherever you are and you decide, hey, it looks like it's a lot of traffic, there's a lot of people over here, they might need rides, click on the app, you might make $20 real quick.
just by picking somebody up, taking them to a shopping center or wherever. So once again, thanks for checking me out and uh, happy Easter. Deuces.